This is actually pretty interesting about um, martial law going to end up happening in uh, Canada. I live in Sarnia, Ontario, Canada, and um, and I was pretty disturbed about this. I had a feeling it was going to happen, and um, and um, I'm like my parents don't believe me. I've been telling them it's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. They're going to take all your food, and they're going to end up controlling people and. They live in Corona, and it's, I kept telling them, "It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Don't believe me. Don't believe me. Wait till it happens." And um, and um, I, I actually am pretty worried about them. And um, also, um, if they actually do actually try to, um, if they actually do try to take all my food, I'm gonna fight back. They can. They can kiss my ass, they can kiss my bare ass, and they can, they can take this from my cold, dead hands. I will not let them do this. The government has no right to do that to people. <laughs> to steal all your food and all that? I'm also a Christian as well, and um, I uh, also re I refuse to get the swine flu vaccine because it has been causing a lot of deaths because of autoimmune disease because of the ingredients in the vaccine, and um, and also um, and I know some people have actually been getting really really sick because of the swine flu vaccine, and. Um, and I've been telling them, they don't get it, don't get it. You're just gonna get sick and die from it. And um, and also it does tie in with the mark of the beast in the book of Revelations. Um, it doesn't mention uh, the vaccine, but it does m mention like with to do with buying and selling and that. Those who refuse to get the mark of the beast will end up being beheaded for their testimony in the word of God and. Um, and they're going to try to force me to actually get the mark. And I'm going to say no. And um, they can try to force me and I won't let them. And um, I pray to those um, that are actually starting to realize what is starting to happen in Canada. And I demand you, I actually uh, recommend you actually rise up against it. Go to a, like a place where there's no one around, and um, like in a like a, I don't know, like maybe like a forest or a field or something, and um, maybe get a vault or something built, and um, maybe put a lot of food in it, like canned foods and fruit, vegetables, whole bunch of different stuff, and um, and a lot of water and all that too, and um, also um, get a lot of herbal medicines while you still can because once martial law hits you lose chance I'm actually gonna be start doing that soon too and um, <clears throat> and the building across from Roger's video on um, on uh, Finch um, there's these two like radio towers like they, they they actually listen to people's conversations all that because they I've actually seen exact same ones, like um when they're showing videos about Area 51 and all that, like in the borders, and they look exactly the same. And uh, once I get my camera, I'll actually upload it. And um, I might get banned from from fa uh, from YouTube for this. And um, I ac actually recommend people upload this and spread it around as to many sources you can and um, I recommend you do store up a lot of food have it hidden really well and make a map or something and um, hide like get a whole bunch of fruit store it places where they like in your homes or underground or something uh, and um, I and I pray to God that you do heed the advice, and um, and also um, they will be monitor. They do monitor people on the um, internet, and um, they're starting to um, 
to upload stuff and I thank Alex Jones also the people who believe in upgrading their hum their rights to life and anti-abortion and all that I'm also against that too because it's not right killing an innocent child why don't they just instead of killing a child why don't, don't they just put the child up for adoption instead of ending a life it's just not right a life is a life unborn and born still is still a life and um so um I recommend you get a whole bunch of natural remedies and all that too because they're gonna ban garlic they're also gonna be banning onions fruit like oranges vitamin C and also a whole bunch of different natural stuff that's good for you and um, do it soon because it's not once you once martial law hits it will be too late thank you and God bless for um, watching this video. Thank you. Bye.